Hi everybody, welcome to Ashley's Treasure. I just got a package in the mail from scrapbook.com that I wanted to share with you guys and unbox with you. So, let's begin. Um, and this time they had them in little rubber bands. Have you ever had that happen ordering from scrapbook.com? I never had them do that, but I don't mind. It actually kind of kept things together, which was nice. Um, first thing I got was more double-sided adhesive tape. Uh, there should be six. One, two, three, four, five, six. Yeah. It's like the cheapest ones I get that I can find right now. Best deal. I got the quarter inch. I've used these for my albums. And I definitely need to restock on those. So I wait on when those go on sale. I got some 6x6 uh, six six paper pad by Pink Plazy. I got the Little Adventure. This is the girls. Baby girls. Which actually... Let's see if I got my scissors. I don't know if you've seen this one yet. Um, I got the boy 6x6 paper pad at Tuesday morning, but I was able to find embellishments for the girls, but not the boys, so, and they, I couldn't find the girls' paper there, so I got that from scrapbook.com. Got little cut-aparts. Just get more light in here. I get no natural light. Is that better? some cute pink hearts pretty floral and then it says white star line got like some grid got the chevrons got the kites got the alphabet and this is like a gray color with white specks on it and this one little unicorns that's cute. Little pink flowers and trees. This looks like green grass. Got some little frames. Totally use those for the album. You could put sayings in there, or you could put design paper behind and do sayings, or you could actually use pictures. Cute flowers. It's the stars. But this one's in pink. I've never seen that in pink. No, they always have it in blue. Got the hot air balloons and then the stripes of the colors. And then I love these little whales. And got little hearts in between them. Because I think that's in the voice too. And got the waves. Definitely use that for mermaids too. And this one this one has just scattered letters. And then that's a repeat. So yeah, definitely going to make a 6x6 girls album and a boys album out of these. And then I've been dying to get this because I have no cloud stencil. And this one's perfect because you can use the top of it and the bottom of it, you know, to do the clouds. And then it's got individual clouds too. So I'm really excited to use this one for cards and whatnot, scrapbooking. And then... This one is, um, what was this one called? Shiplap siding. But I was thinking, because I am horrible at making straight lines, but this one's thin that I could use to um, for my albums. You know, when you want some to write notes on, I could use this as my stencil to do straight lines. Or And it's always fun, too, using um, texture paste for scrapbooking. So, yeah, it's got two uses out of that. And then um, this one, it's got thicker lines, which I was using more for the texture paste because I wanted one with stripes and I really like this one. And then I also got this stencil. Got like that gingham. I'm a sucker for plaid and gingham and checkers. I love that. Use ink and stuff. Texture paste. And then I got the... A Little Adventures stickers. I got the boy and the girl. So it's baby. It's got like a cat and the lion. Because some of these you can use on either one. Like the lion you can use on the, on the boys too. And this little frame you could use on the boys. You know, you can use the star on the boys. Adventure, sunshine. And I the reason why I really want this because it's got the months. Because I always like doing albums with all the months of them for the first year. It's got a nice border on there. 
Got the cute fox. So that one you could use for the boys too. It's on the bottom. I can't quite see on the bottom. Oh, Chase Rainbows. That's so cute. And Dream. You can use that on the boys. Oh, it's got a little ladybug too. That's so cute. Okay. And then this one's the boys. That one says Baby 2. Got Goldfish. See, some of these you can use on the girls too. And girls can have blue little hearts. No little hearts. I love you. Cute adventure. Sunshine. I love you to the moon and back. And it's got stars down there. And then it's got borders. Yeah, because on the girls, there's where hearts with gold foil. And I love these little gold stars. It's got the months. Got a little book. Oh, that'd be great for my boy because we read books like crazy. Be brave, little one. <laughs> Got a little ducky and a train. Maybe boy, new baby, adorable, perfect. So cute. But yeah, so I'm going to make two 6x6 six six albums out of that. And I needed some embellishments to work with. And what was this? Your stamp inside. Thank you for your order. Scrapbook.com Oh, this was one of the... I got some free stuff from there. I was so excited about it because who can say no to free stuff? I didn't open out it. Here, stamp inside. This is actually smaller than I thought it was. Come on, I got that sticky stuff on there. But yeah, I got this for free from the last time I ordered, which was like last year. And then they emailed me a code where I could get this free and I never used it and I just had it sitting in my cart forever and so since I got all these deals like I was still able to use this on top of it so I was really glad that I was still able to use this even though it's been like a year ago but um but yeah it wasn't bad for free it says uh thinking of you happy happy birthday you know a couple different ones uh thanks just for you really cute to make cards with for free, not so bad. And this shows like other ones that they got. And then I got some ink. I had to get the new Distressed Oxide, the Speckled Egg, because I love the light blue. Like the tumble, or Tumbled Glass is my favorite one. And then they had the Speckled Egg one. I had to get it. And it was... Actually, scrapbook.com was the cheapest place I could find it so far because of being new. But yeah, I can't wait to use that one. Oh, so juicy. Actually, do I have some scrap paper? One second. Here's some little cards, scrap card stock. Oh, can't wait to use this. So excited. I've seen so many projects already with it. I have like every shade of blue with the stress oxide. Uh, love it. And then I've been trying to get this for the longest time. This is Hero Arts Hero Hues Unicorn White. And um, who is it? Uh, she makes amazing cards. She's like amazing. I love watching her YouTube videos. Um, Jennifer McGuire. She makes amazing cards, and this is her favorite white ink to use, and I had to get it because I've seen her use it so many times, and I really love it when she does, like, for cards, she does, like, background stamps on, like, cardstock with this, and it shows up so good, so I'm, like, dying to use this. Yay! I'm so excited I got it, because at first they were out. They've been out of it for, like, so long, and they finally restocked, so I was excited. And then, I don't know why I have these in so many bags. Probably should have opened some of this, but I was so excited. I wanted to open it with you. Uh, I got the Nouveau's Crystal Drops. And this one's going to be more clear. I can't remember what this one color was called. Oh, right there. 
<laughs> silly bee. Morning dew. So yeah, it's going to be like a clear one. Because you always need that. And you can make like, they're normally around $5, wasn't it? But you get so much out of these. I like it. I love it how you can make it your own size. Because I like teeny tiny little dots sometimes for my cards and stuff. So it's nice having the clear one, especially for like the water theme. It has clear, so it looks like bubbles. Love it. And then, got some stamps. And this one was really cute. This was the one like $3.99. But it says, just for you, handmade for you, uh, paper ink love, made with love, handmade by, which I thought would be perfect because I don't have anything like that for my albums to put like in the back of them, you know, so I know who it's made from. And for the cards too, so this was perfect. And it's so tiny and cute. And it's the perfect size too love that I so needed that and then I got this for free I was so cute I'm like little penguins and I got two different ones I got snowflakes be merry and then it's got hats and candy canes and a little bow so you can decorate them so the bow could be for a girl or you can put it on his chest so it looks like a boy it's so cute warmest holiday wishes and then I was looking for uh, um, cameras, stands for cameras, but when I make my albums, I put, put cameras there where to place photos, and I was trying to get a variety of different ones, because not all albums are like the same, you know, design, some of them are more whimsical, some of them are more detailed, you know, so I needed a variety of different cameras, and I thought that was a a little bit bigger than I was expecting, but I still really like it. And I could definitely use all the other ones, like Picture Perfect and Smile, Congrats. I would use this um, for when I do flowers. You always need some leaves in there. You could easily print that out and cut that out and stick them in there. It's so nice and got a little wreath. And thanks so much. Big day. You are the best. So easy to use for multiple reasons. Little heart for cards, scrapbooking, you name it. And then I saw these flowers and they were so gorgeous, I couldn't say no to them. Look how gorgeous those are. So I want to make cards and butterflies, you can never go wrong with butterflies. I probably have so many stamps with butterflies. But you always need different ones, you know? But yeah, this would be great for a thank you card. I love that font. I just, I couldn't say no to it. And I got some of the embellishments for the little adventures of the boy one because I got the girl one at Tuesday morning so now I'll have some of the boys I'm so excited let's see a little something something let's look through those it's got the little oh it's a mommy and a baby whale that is so cute this is shiny okay, let me move this Got a little goldfish. Ooh, glittery star. I didn't know they were glittery. Got a blue hot air balloon. Cute little elephant. Got a tag. Got a little helper here. Teddy bear. Oh, there's a sign you could write anything in there. You could write their name when they were born, you know. Adventure this way or, you know, anything. Yes. There's a plane. Telescope. Oh, and there's some gold glitter on that, too. Oh, an elephant. Yeah. And a bear. A little ticket. This one. I kissed a bear. Oh, that's so sweet of you. Young souls. Run wild and free. That's cute with a little zebra. And I kissed the elephant. <laughs> and the book again. Another gold star. A little fox. I, I kissed the whales. A quail, that's different. Globe, a little ducky. The fox. Let's see the bigger side. Oh, well, there's like some frames in here. So much in here. How many pieces are in here? Let's have a look. I love I love Oh, look at a little flag. Got gold on it too. It's got that little frame. Whoa. Great for a picture. Yep, and there's another frame. 
Oh, this one's got gold on it. Oh, yeah, I love that one. I'm seeing it. Oh. Little mountain. Kid, you move mountains. Look. Oh, that's so cute. And it's got a little thing there. So glad I found Nice blue frame. Definitely put a picture of that. Could use that for the cover. This one? Oh, that's big. Tiny? That's not tiny. That's big. <laughs> What else? Oh, there's cute little trees. Love that. Oh, the boat, trees. USS. I think the trees. Milestones. Yeah, milestones. Oh, the there's a little green. map. And then a blue tree. Little tag. Oh, there's another little blue tree. Another little Oh, a little bunny, little pile of bugs. Mm. Little one. Ooh, this train is big. Definitely put like a picture on top of it or below it. So cute. Can't wait to make that. Put that aside. I I want to see the dinosaurs. Yes, and then I got these for my son. They're a lot smaller than I thought they were, but they were only like a dollar something because he loves dinosaurs. So I got these for you, buddy. I don't know if I can open it. Oh, there we go. Love it. I, know. I don't want to tear this open. I could definitely use this. It's from Paper House. Ooh, I thought these were like bigger. But got some cute dinos in it. I think you would put them on you. Definitely a lot smaller than I thought they were going to be. So yeah, I'm a little bummed out on that. I thought they were bigger than that. But they're still cute and can definitely use. Right? Yep. Because you love dinos, huh? I put a T-Rex on you. Oh, thanks. And then got these snowflake ones. Merry Christmas. Peace on Earth. This would be great for my Christmas cards this year. I love big fonts like that. And I keep on using the same one over and over, so I needed something different. And I love that. And the snowflakes are very thin and delicate, you know? Love that. I'm, I'm excited to make Christmas cards. Good. I'm not ready for Christmas yet. And then I got some sheets. I'm gonna, I'm gonna like use these for like a whole new day. Okay, go play with them. Ooh, you okay? Yeah. Sorry, you just shook the table. And then I love how they always use this to keep your paper straight. And I use this cardboard to make albums with because it's yeah, it's not as thick as mine is, but it's thick enough, especially for junk journals. I so keep these. It's great. And then I got some of the 12 by 12 sheets um, for in the uh, Little Adventures so I can use them for the cover of the albums. Um, this one I was going to use for the cover of the boys. I got the hot air balloon. I can't remember if it has a name for it or not. Hmm. Then it also has the stripes on it too, so I was kind of debating like which side should I use for the 6x6 album. Probably the balloons. The balloons are pretty cute. And then I got this one for the cover of the girls. Man, why did I get this one? Oh, because of this side. <laughs> this one's from Casercraft. I always love their paper. But I love this because it was like the watercolor look. It's got that light blue to white. I love that. So definitely using that for a scrapbook layout. And then, got these little wood veneers that came with the collection. They're a little staticky. There's a little, there's a little chip there. Oh, that's a bummer. It's got the uh, sign I'm again. I'm in my, I'm in my dino decoration. Oh, that's so cute. Look what you did. You put it on a popsicle stick. That's so cute. That was a good idea, bud. I love it. You can do little puppets with it. A uh, little cloud, hearts, baby. Oh, that's such a cute little moon. More clouds, tiny. I like how like small these are. These are perfect. Baby, you got a little teddy bear. Cloud. More clouds. Lots of clouds. Oh, it's got the little whale. I love that. Another teddy bear. Another tiny little. So I could definitely use this for both of them. Which is more than enough. Sweet. Little stars. 
Another duck. More hearts. Oh, a duck. A duck. Yep, little ducks. Sweet again. So yeah, it seems like you get all the letterings twice. Don't bump the table. Got lots of hearts and moons. So yeah, it seems like you get like two of each at least. That's pretty awesome. Well, besides the sign. The sign. So that was definitely worth it. And they're not too, too thick. So yeah, definitely using that for the albums. And I love dyeing them and painting them. Embossing them. The little baby bear. And then, last but not least, I got these because I thought it was vellum. And I was going to use them for like pockets. And found out it was actually cardstock. But they're like embossed. Mm. They're little um, rain clouds and got glitter falling from it. And so I got, oh, they gave me an extra one. I only ordered two. Mm -hmm. huh. Well, that's a bonus. These so I end up getting cool. two. <laughs> Mom, these are cool. Yeah, they are, aren't they? Let me get out of this shiny plastic. Probably blinding you. All the glares. Yeah, you can definitely feel the um, clouds pop out. And I need a sister. So cool. And then it's got the glittery raindrops. Yeah, you can see how it pops out. So yeah, I still definitely use that for the albums. And I got an extra one. How cool is that? So, hmm. Do I use this for the covers? I don't know. Gotta figure that out. And then, of course, got the magazine. Because that's free too. Why not, you know? Whenever something's free, you can't say no to it. Which I don't really do my albums like this, but it always gives me ideas and for albums and stuff. It's always fun to look at, and they're free, so why not? Yeah. Shows you new products. Yeah, huh, I got that. So cool. But yeah, that's what we got. And the next day, found out that they were having another sale in. Um, if you do that VIP where you let them message you, um, I'm sorry, the table's shaking again. Um, they give you like coupons and stuff. Well, they actually had something free. So of course I had to get it. So I had to get, you had to spend like, was it $25 or more in order to get it. So I ended up ordering some more stuff. So it should come tomorrow, it says. So stay tuned and you'll be able to see what else I got from scrapbook.com. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to hit the subscribe button and the bell for notification. Bye.